hello guys welcome back to the channel if today is your first time of tuning in you are highly welcome please take some seconds and hit the subscribe button down below if you haven't done so please do that so you can join the family and thank you as you do so so guys in today's video we are going to be making home remedy that can help you grow thick eyebrows and your edges yes that's what we are going to be making today and to do that all you need is your vaseline yeah, if you don't have Vaseline, you can use coconut oil in place of Vaseline, okay? So now I'll go ahead and add about one tablespoon of Vaseline into a plate, into a clean plate. So once that is done, I'll set it aside. Now I'll go ahead and get my blender. Once that is done, the next ingredient we are going to be using is cloves. I'll go ahead and add about three tablespoons of cloves into the blender yeah these are the two ingredients we'll be using for this treatment and guys believe me cloves when it comes to cloves cloves are very effective when it comes to growing a healthy hair in fact if you want to grow anything hair just try incorporating cloves to whatever you will be using in growing your hair okay Cloves contain a huge oil which promotes hair growth and adds shine to the hair. It helps treat dandruff and prevent premature graying of hair. Cloves also help to stop hair loss, cleanse and suit the scalp. Yeah, that's why I said earlier, if you're trying to grow a healthy hair, try to incorporate cloves in whatever you will be using in growing your hair. So now guys, I'll go ahead and blend the one I have in the blender. I'll blend it until smooth. Now I'm done blending it. The next thing I will do is I'll go ahead. I'll go ahead and get a chiffon cloth. If you don't have a chiffon cloth, you can as well use a sieve with a tiny openings. Okay. So I'll place the chiffon cloth on top of the plate. Then I'll go ahead and pour in the, the blended cloth into the uh, into the chiffon cloth this is because i want to sieve it i want to collect the powder the the ones in powder form i don't want any form of lumps in the mixture that's why i decided to sieve it okay but that doesn't mean that it, you cannot add it you cannot add it directly after blending it you can do that okay guys but i decided to sieve it so now i'll go ahead and sieve So now guys, I'm done sieving it and this is what I have. This is what I found out that the ones I sieved out, they are not much. It's not enough for me. So <laughs> I will still go ahead and add some of the unsieved one. Yeah, I will still go ahead and add the ones not sieved like I'm doing now. I will add small amount of it. That's why I said it's also good if you decide not to sieve it at all. Okay. So I'll proceed to the next stage, which is here I have my, um, I have a saucepan with water boiling already. I'll go ahead and place the plate into the saucepan. Now I'll go ahead and mix everything very well. I'm, I will mix the vaseline and the blended cloves very well. So after mixing it, I will allow it to sit there for some minutes so that it will dissolve, so that the vaseline oil will melt. So after some minutes, you guys can see the oil is beginning to melt. But I'll still go ahead and stir it, stir it until everything melts very well. So after some minutes, I will check it again. I will mix it again. now it's ready it's ready so the next thing i have to do is to take it off the cooker we'll proceed to the next stage so here it is 
look at it guys look at it as you can see now the blended clothes and vesting has mixed very well as you all can see so the next thing i have to do is to get a container i'll be storing it in this container now i'll go ahead and fill the container with with this treatment then once that is done i will I will set it aside and allow it to cool down. So now it has cooled down, the oil has solidified and this is what it looks like. I will go ahead and show you guys how you can use this, okay? This will last for you as, you know, <laughs> It can last for you for months okay you don't have any problem you can just store it and be using it let me show you guys how to use it so guys here I am I'm about to show you guys how you can use this to grow your eyebrows I will show you guys how you can actually um, use this okay as you all can see this is it so what I normally do is that in the evening time after washing my face, I'll go ahead and take small portion of it. As you all can see, it has solidified very well. I'll take small portion of it and I'll go ahead and apply it on my eyebrows like this. After applying it, you don't need to wash it out. Just leave it there. Continue to do this within one week. You will see your eyebrows growing so thick and dark Yes You can also use this on your edges if you're losing your edges You can actually apply this on your edges and it really works guys. Yeah, so this is how you actually use this to grow your eyebrows Yeah, try it and let me know. Okay Try it and let me know Because this is what I use I will show you guys my eyebrows before and now. I will leave the clip here before and now, okay? So after applying it, you just leave it. Go to bed, wake up, and continue with your daily activities. So guys, that is it. Please, if you've watched to this point, please kindly give us a thumbs up, comment, share. Just like this video if it pleases you, okay? Comment and share this video, okay, guys? I will see you all in my next one. Thank you all. Bye-bye.